Hey everybody, what's up? Welcome to Farming Simulator 2017. Today we are back with a Chevy 2500 HD 6.6 Duramax. Now this truck is an interesting, uh, has an interesting story behind it. So I got the model for a 2500 HD a 2006. I believe I was the first one to put one out, and then a ton of other people made their own versions of it. I'm not saying I was the pioneer or anything, but I just got my hands on a model for a 2006 Duramax and I wanted to make it into a truck, so I made it into a truck. It wasn't the greatest, I mean, by no means. I, I still like it, I just. Yeah. Wasn't the greatest, but whatever. Anyway, so I saw this truck. It had originally had a plow on it and a sander in the back. The plow I didn't make or anything, but the sander I, I made from scratch, so I thought that was. A, I didn't realize it at first. I was like, I just got to seeing this, you know, the, either the red sander that I made, the boss one. I just got so used to seeing it, I completely forgot that I even made that from scratch. So I saw it, and I was like, oh, I don't want a plow truck. So I took all that stuff out of there, and I fixed this truck up a little bit. And I got to dig it around, and I was like, oh, wait, I made that sander. Someone put that on here. And I was like, oh, wait, I made that box, too. I didn't make it, but I, it was from my original truck. And I was like, oh, and like I was looking at the XML and I was like, this is all my work. I remember putting all this stuff in there. So, yeah, so the box is from my truck that I did. The cab is from the 2006 uh, truck that had a, you could put a flatbed on it and all kinds of other options. And no, no, this was the one that just, uh, just had the flatbed on it, I believe think so not completely sure there's a couple couple of these trucks out now but I really like this truck because of the bumper and it's you know it had the light part and stuff that was pretty cool it had a lift and it had a wheels I, I really haven't seen too many other mods that are this well done in farm sim so I mean I think this is a pretty cool truck I mean I made a roll call uh, they had a big old bumper on the back but I took it off and just made it black uh, they put a 4x4 four four decals and came on there those are pretty cool but yeah, the box is from my truck. The cab is from something else. That's fine. I mean, I was, I was glad to see it. I completely forgot. Like, I was like, really forgot about the truck. I was like, oh wow, that's a good truck. Oh, I actually made a lot of that truck. Oh yeah, the light bars are cool. The mirrors are cool. Looks like a really nice truck. Yeah, I put a fifth wheel on here. The gooseneck. I got a gooseneck hooked up right now. It's not, it doesn't pull the greatest, but it pulls pretty good. You saw my truck running around, you know, looking cool. Here you go. There was something else I wanted to say about this mod, I can't remember right now. But, uh, anyways, just don't look inside, don't get in it. <laughs> that's, that's all I'll say. It's uh, a bit basic in there, but anyways, we'll start it up. Rolls call. I do it for all my trucks. Drives pretty nice. It's The game may seem like we're at a low FPS, because we are. Unfortunately, it's because I have a ton of stuff over here by the shop. Uh, this has kind of become my test map. There's just stuff everywhere, but it'll keeps going back up as we uh, go this way. Oh, the brake lights don't work. I legitimately never tested the brake lights. So I will put brake lights on it now. I just thought this was a cool mod. Figure I'd fix it up a little bit. Put her out there. I couldn't find a version without the plow and the sander on it. I think this. I think it was originally edited by. Um, Punka Dylan. Don't quote me on that. Or however you want to say it. For the longest time, a couple days, I couldn't get it above like 20 FPS. I was like, I was really struggling to find out what was wrong. And I, there were a bunch of errors in it. I said, I didn't want to fix these errors if 
couldn't guarantee that it would make it better because at that point, I mean, I wasn't even really going to put any more time into the truck. I'm not going to release a truck that's coming out 15 FPS. But I just sat down and said, you know what, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to fix them, see if it works. I spent about three hours fixing errors on this mod and it did actually fix it. So. Tension belts do work. You know, all your typical stuff. No beacons or anything on here. Let's see if I can make this turn. Came back up. I'm at the wall. That was not how I anticipated this to go, but. Well, I'm stuck. So, we'll ditch the trailer. And we'll just drive up without the trailer. So there you go, there's the 2006 Duramax 2500 HD. Thank you for watching, if you like this video leave a like, leave a comment, tell me your thoughts below, I'll leave a link to download it in the description, and I will catch you again in the next video.